field and we're on to the final stretch. This week it's about the text. This is your final layer. Okay, so it's the last week today to get this last layer on it. So you can see here I've got three in front of me. You're not expected to do three. I just had three on the go because I was trying to use as many different forms of media as I can to give you a true representation. We've got layer one, which was your background layer, which was either the tea stain, the coffee stain, the collage or the cardboard. We have layer two, which was the pattern where you chose a um, an icon, an image that maybe you simplified and you created as the pattern background. You have layer three, which was your tonal drawing of the object that you wanted to draw to simplify this lockdown period. That was probably the hardest, longest task. And then layer four today. So you can see I haven't done this one yet. I wanted to leave this one for my example today, but I've done these two. The final layer is the text layer. I want you to go away and I want you to have a look, I want you to have a research, I want you to have a research of quotes that you've maybe, inspirational quotes from this lockdown period, things that you maybe have heard being said. I've gone here and I've actually found some quotes that kept appearing throughout my days that I kind of want to remember that, so this one here it says nothing is certain and every little thing is beautiful. I kind of wanted to put that on with the toilet rolls because it's that irony of when it first happened and all those toilet rolls go missing. The middle one that said here is the world beautiful and terrible which is the fact that with our beauty there is these extreme things that happen but hopefully it will make us appreciate those beautiful things more. And this one now is just what I'm going to do with you. Okay so for this one, this one was a little bit more medical, it's a bit more NHS, it's got the masks, the Covid, it's got the hands for the hand washing and the hands clapping. I wanted to find a quote that was a little bit more about us having to adapt to this new world and I found a quote that I really liked. Okay, it's a really simple task this week. Get yourself on the internet, have a Google for different quotes. I've chosen a quote for this last one that says, don't doubt your ability to adapt. With that, I've then found um, newspapers, I've got some scissors, I've also actually drawn myself some of my own text and what I want you to do is find all the letters, so for instance I've just been trying to find the letters for um, ability, so I decided to use an A that I've drawn myself, you can see I've cut them out in little rectangles, there's my B, I, I like each letter to actually have a different font, even if it's only slightly different, but it is different I, I believe it gives it more visual interest when you're looking at it so T and then Y so you can see I've literally cut out every letter drawn some in my own found different fonts cut them out in these rectangles and I'm going to find the whole words words don't doubt your ability to adapt I also want to have the um, quotation marks which I've already cut out like that I will find them I will come back to you in a moment Okay, so here's my piece. What I need to start doing now is deciding where I want my letters to go. So I think the first word I want is to actually go right up here at the top. So I won't glue it down until I'm 100% happy with where my letters are going. I will move them around a bit. It's got to work as a composition. I will want them to be on different lines. Okay, so I've got them all in place now. So now it's time to get it all stuck down. Okay, first finish one with a tea stain background, tonal drawing of a clock and toilet rolls, the rainbow saying nothing is certain and every little thing is beautiful. Okay, next one. This one had the collage background of the letter, the tea bag, the bit of newspaper from the day, the kitchen towel, the cardboard, all tea stained with the um, pattern made up of the COVID-19 symbol, the drawing of the dream catcher and here is the world beautiful and terrible. Lastly, the piece of corrugated cardboard with the pattern of the COVID-19 in the face masks, the drawing of the hand and don't doubt your ability to adapt. <laughs> 